All right, I'm gonna wait just a second uh, for this thing to kind of link up here. <laughs> uh, I guess I should say something about this live video. stream is connected before you go live. Alright, uh, whatever. Uh, can... My thing says I am connected. So, uh, we're linked up. Hello, Facebook. Uh, good to see you. Guess I'll go live here. Alright, there we go. I guess I'm doing this right. I don't, I don't know. Um... I look down and I see my big head. Alright, um, so hey everybody, in case you don't know me, uh, I'm Jack from Indie Spotlight. And I just wanted to throw a quick video up to kind of update everybody on uh, what's up, what's going on, and what's coming. Uh, first, I guess uh, the daily videos are coming back. Um, working day shifts for the next couple of days so I'll be able to sit here and go through my YouTube stuff schedule that out so I would say probably in the next couple of days you're gonna start seeing them at noon every day and I'm gonna try to keep up with that this time try <coughs> excuse me I guess the next important thing to tell you folks is the live streaming broadcast is coming back and I'm not sure on dates times or anything like that I, all I know is I um I had a musician that hit me up uh, here on Facebook wanting to do an interview and I'm like man I, I, I can the, the show like a long time ago but I been wanting to bring it back, been meaning to bring it back. Um, so what I'm thinking, and this is where I'd like you guys to kind of help me out on this, is I need a sh okay. It's, obviously, it's going to be indie spotlight, just like it always has been. But it's going to be like a season. Uh, I've noticed this is kind of a trend on the internet, especially like on YouTube. Uh, so maybe like a season not, which doesn't necessarily mean like a span of time and then I take off and disappear again but like a series of shows I guess this is, is probably the best way to put this um, like say for like a span of series I focus on the blue like say blues artist for example and call it Indie Spotlight, the bluey, bluesy edition. Or say I focus on, like say, more of a progressive uh, like kind of thing. And say, call it Indie Spotlight, I don't know. Think of the name. But I think the first series of shows is going to be Indie Spotlight Rebooted. Where it's going to be a similar but not exact format as to what I was doing before I think the biggest takeaway is going to be instead of just uh, coming in plug it in and playing the music what I think it's going to be it's every week it's going to be truly indie spotlight whereas I focus on a particular artist or musician and they're like the spotlight of the show I kind of did something like this before, but it was, mm, it, mm, I didn't like the way it sounded. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to play with that just a little bit. Um, and, and that's kind of where I'm going with this. I, and I will be using camup.tv. Uh, 
once again, uh, Cam Up has always been really, really, really good. Uh, to Indie Spotlight, Dixie's been awesome, Dixie and his team. I have to tell you guys right off the bat, okay, I don't think there's anybody on the internet that has been a bigger promoter and pusher of ad blocker. I love it. I think it's probably saved me from God knows how many viruses and everything else. And I'm going to call it for what it is. Back on the blog TV days, which we're talking, what, 13, they went out of, so what, five years ago now plus. <coughs> Excuse me. They would put ads in, like, the worst possible places. Like, every time, and, and, and the website sucked. It would crash, and then when you had to refresh it, you had to watch another damn video. So you'd miss like 30 seconds up to a minute of the show. And that's when I became a, a big, I'm like, Ad Blocker Plus, just saying. Wink, wink. I will have to ask you folks, uh, checking out camup.tv, please disable your ad blocker. And as a matter of fact, I think he's got it set up so you have to anyway. Cam Up is a grassroots thing. The ads are not anywhere intrusive. They're there, but they don't color up the video or or you know click yes for more nothing like that they're on the site but you scroll up and down you see them yeah that's kind of how they make their money and they're not very big right now let's help them out right anyway that's m my feeling on that disable your ad blocker when you check out the show on camup.tv so I guess the final thing is, Jack, when the hell are you going to do the show? Everybody's had a different idea, times, dates, etc. Uh, we did the coffee break morning show. That was actually a pretty, pretty good success. The problem is I'm really not a morning person, people. So, and, and on top of that, our work retail, uh, my schedule's fairly consistent but not always for the longest time I stuck with nine o'clock on Sunday nights just for the simple fact that that was the date and time that I knew for a fact that I could pop in here and get the show going so I uh, I need to work on that um, I'm gonna be flat out honest Sunday night has literally become like the internet graveyard for that kind of thing so I need to think of another date and time, especially as, you know, musician interviews, that sort of thing. I don't want to can it, and what I mean by can it is I don't want to, like, pre-record stuff and then play it later. Uh, it's more fun when, especially, you know, when you get a musician on, for example, musician interview, you get, um, you get their fans in the chat, so to speak who they love to interact with and when you pre-record stuff you you don't get that so i don't know and i see there's a comment in the chat hello kevin <laughs> but anyway uh so that is the show update uh everything in the spotlight as it were i was gonna type a note but i don't feel like typing a whole bunch of crap so i just figured i'd let make a video. Yeah, you can share a video, right? So that's kind of where we're going. So again, uh, to recap, uh, rebooting the live broadcast. Daily videos are coming back to the Facebook page. Please like and share them. And more stuff coming soon. Yeah, there's a voice. Yeah, tell me about it, Kevin. I could say the same about you, brother. How you been? Like. Uh, so that's what we got going on. So again, and like I said, not to beat a dead horse, uh, but if you visit the show on camup.tv, uh, again, disable your ad blocker. I know this is the exact opposite of what I've probably been telling you guys for the last 10 years, okay? <laughs> but they actually need the ad revenue. Not back in the old, like I said, God, blog TV. You know what feels really weird, especially since I got Kevin hanging out here. I might as well just hang out and keep talking. You know, it feels so weird to be talking about that in the past tense. 
and to know that it was so long ago. Freaky. Let me see. It's 2018. It was 2008. I was doing a talk show on <laughs> Blog Talk Radio. We made our Indie Spotlight debut the following year, and so, yeah. 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 I'm bringing it back one more time. I must be crazy. Actually, I am crazy about the music. I've got so much new stuff that so many of you guys have never heard. You know, and I, I kind of blame, I blame a bunch of different things, really. I could, I could write a book. The Life and Times of Vindu Spotlight. I'll give you the Reader's Digest condensed version, especially if you're kind of new to the Facebook page and don't really have any idea what any of this is all about, and you made it, oh god, I'm ten minutes in to the video. Oh my god, Kevin. Oh my god. Oh, that's a flashback. Oh, I don't want to think about that. Ugh. Ooh. Anyway, um, long story made short. History of Indies. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to say. Uh, we made our, our live streaming debut on Blog TV in May of 2009 stuck with it and what what's kind of killed us since is that we've had to change broadcasting platforms so many times I found a website which shall remain nameless even though they don't exist anymore because they kind of pulled the rug out of us it was we're having problems stand by and then two months later <laughs> gone um, I was using another website that was for podcast which is really cool but then that went away I found cam up. Cam up's awesome, but there's uh, okay. You know what? And this is what I didn't do on cam up, or haven't done on cam up, but I'm going to do it now. Is get involved in more shows on the site itself and kind of make myself known, begin a network again, maybe rebuild the Indie Spotlight brand as a live streaming format again. Who in the hell knows? But I'll tell you this: the, the live, the blah, 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 blah. stop. Daily videos are coming back. Live streaming broadcast is coming back. I think I've already got a musician interview on deck. So watch this page. Stuff's coming soon. Uh, Till then, uh, take care and thank you all for watching.